Hello everybody, welcome back to another fossil hunting video. It's a bit of a wet morning today, hopefully the rain stays off but I'm well wrapped up. Let's head on round to the beach and see what fossils we can find. I did find something quite special towards the end of last week, so make sure you stick around to the very end of the video to see what I found. The pathway on the way down to the beach is certainly looking quite a bit overgrown, but it's still nowhere near as bad as some other locations on the Yorkshire coast. I've made it down onto the beach now, the sea is looking nice and calm, let's have a look through the rocks and I'll come back to you on my first find of the day. Right where I'm stood here there's a partial ammonite just poking out. It's a little section of a harpoceros ammonite, it's not complete but it's still a really cool thing to pick up. Remember guys, if you do enjoy watching my fossil hunting videos and you'd like to see more in the future, please hit that subscribe button and give the video a like if you have enjoyed it. There's an ammonite right here on the floor, look. In fact, there's a little ammonite right there and there's one which looks a bit worn that I've just spotted here. It's definitely seen better days, but always nice to find. This piece on the floor could be interesting. Can you spot it? It looks a bit like ribs. It's either ribs or fishbone. Let's take it out and have a look. It's only a very small piece, unfortunately. Little pieces of ichthyosaur rib and a little bone there as well, maybe a vertebra. Cool little pickup. Quite a bit of crushing on this ammonite, which is a shame. Look at that, that's how I like to find them. Totally beach prepped. That's lovely. Can't go wrong with that. There's a cracking looking ammonite right here. Looks complete. You can see the keel where my thumb is. Brilliant, that's a really nice one. Look at that. So there was a lot of rain forecasted so I made sure I brought my waterproofs and my big coat and so far it's not even rained once. Very slippy surfaces that I'm walking down. You need to take it very steady and always be prepared to slip over because it catches you when you least expect it normally. Check out this little beauty that I've just cracked open. A really nice splitter. And also just in front of me, there's a, another lovely looking ammonite here. Although it's just got a little bit of damage on the side of it which is a bit of a shame. Unfortunately, there's nothing inside it except these weird, but you sometimes get in these type of nodules. And also next to it, I've just tapped a little section of an ammonite showing, and there was a, and there was a harpocerus inside. But unfortunately, it's just worn away half of it. It's really a shame. It's been lovely. Oh well, maybe another day.
This little shale slab looks quite interesting. There's a ammonite preserved here. There's an Elegantisserus ammonite preserved here. And there's possibly the remainder of another. Usually they're quite crushed, but this could be inside a nodule. So I guess I'll get the chisel out and see what exactly it is. Check out this one, guys. There's a nice looking ammonite inside here. I'm hoping it's an ammonite and not shells inside this quite pyritic nodule. Yep, pretty sure it's an ammonite. Look, you can see it goes all the way around. There's a little bit missing there. Let's give it a tap open in a minute. So here's a closer look at that ammonite. Very pleased how it opened. There's definitely a nice big ammonite inside there. Lovely Elegantissera species. And look at that lovely colouring of the shell. Absolutely beautiful. I'm tempted just to leave it how it is. Look at them beautiful colours on that shell. Now it's time for me to show you that lovely find that I found last week. Beautiful articulated vertebras. Hi everyone, hope you're all doing well. I'm absolutely drenched at the moment. You'll probably see this on the end of another video because I've not done that much filming today, but I found something really special. I just spotted this really cool find. It's ichthyosaur vertebras. You can see the neural arches running right across the top and there's a vertebra at the other end so that means it's a nice articulated piece of really quite small bones. I'm guessing counting the neurals there's going to be about five or six vertebras inside there. There's also quite a lot of ribs running through the bottom of the piece and when you turn the bone pebble over there's lots of little ribs running across the other side as well. It's really quite a neat piece so I'm really happy I found this. Hopefully you've enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching guys, remember to hit the like and subscribe button and I'll see you on the next video.